Hey everyone, it's Ashley. Welcome back to my channel. So today, if you're watching on video, you can probably see this is my holiday candle collection. At least that's what I'm calling it. So this is basically everything I have for this time of year and I just wanted to walk you through it. This uh, probably won't be a very long video, but um, in case you're watching or listening only, like not watching on audio. I just kind of wanted to go through and say everything. Um, if you're watching on video, you can probably see, but I'm just gonna go through and kind of share everything. So this is what I'm going to be picking from pretty much now through the end of the year, um, or at least through Christmas when I transition into like my post-holiday winter candles. So let's just get right into it. I'll just uh, go through these and yeah, if you see a favorite, let me know down below. So up here on the top left, we have Under the Christmas Tree, The Perfect Christmas, Salted Caramel Eggnog. We have two tree farms because last season I accidentally bought two of these during a like large um, sale that was going on. I thought I was buying one of everything and then I realized I actually bought two of those. Goldenberry Mistletoe, Vanilla Bean Noel, Tis the Season, Fa La La Latte, that one's always hard to say. Uh, two Winter Candy Apple, one of these, I think it's this one, is a little bit burned and this one is not. Marshmallow Fireside, Twas the Night Before Christmas, Vanilla Snowflake, that one's a little bit hard to see with the reflection. Under the Christmas Tree, the Perfect Christmas, Hometown Sugar Cookies. This one I feel like could be more slightly fall, um, but I, I'm i kind of past fall, so <laughs> I'm including it here. Cranberry Woods, uh, Tipsy Elf, Cookies with Santa, and Vanilla Balsam. Some of these, like Tipsy Elf, for example, Twas the Night Before Christmas, the Sugar Cookie one, um, Vanilla Bean Noel even, even like Marshmallow Fireside. I feel like some of these I could do post-Christmas, but because of their names, I wanted to include them with my holiday candles. So that's why they're in this bucket, if you will. Um, and then here at the bottom for single wicks, I have Vanilla Balsam, Vanilla Balsam, <laughs> Tis the Season, Marshmallow Fireside, uh, Tree Farm, Vanilla Bean Noel, Cranberry Woods, and The Perfect Christmas. For some reason, I had my Marshmallow Firesides with my Christmas stuff. So I... Don't know why I had it with that instead of the fall stuff, but I just have a lot of fall candles. So I have a better chance of using them with this. So this is all my Bath and Body Works. Um, yeah, I don't think I have any Goose Creek or anything here. Uh, I do have a couple homework slash miscellaneous. So on a, I'm going to pop over there to show you those. And yeah. Okay, sorry for this wild angle here, but I have these separate from my Bath and Body Works just because of their awkward sizes. Um, so I have over here two Homeworks candles. I have a Christmas cappuccino and a Christmas cupcake. I have a Wishing for Christmas from Country Candle. This is a Walmart, um, Better Homes and Gardens. This is a Vanilla Bean and Myrrh. I'm not sure where this Marion Bright is from. It could be from like home goods maybe and then this one in the back from target the threshold brand is cypress and juniper this is like my big five wick or at least four wick um i'm really excited to get after that this season so yeah this is definitely just a short and sweet video here but i just wanted to share before i put all these away um kind of in my storage to pick out from uh what i had going for this holiday season if you guys like this video i think i might do another one after christmas with like my kind of stash for what I have post Christmas winter, if that makes sense. Um, but yeah, I see other people share these and I just felt like I wanted to as well and just kind of remind myself what I have. As you can probably see, a lot of these are unburnt. So um, I'm going to be posting my monthly candle chat videos to kind of just like continue to bring these to the forefront and work on them. But yeah, just wanted to share. Thanks for watching. See you next time.